Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to fix network problems in your Android box. So, i uh, just going to show you, I'm going to go to Google Play Store to see if it's working. As you can see here, my Google Play Store is not opening, so there is a problem with my Wi-Fi connection. So to check the problem, you go to Settings, Network and Internet. Go to your Wi-Fi. It says connected, but I don't have any Wi-Fi connection. You go to your Wi-Fi settings. It should say excellent here. If it says fair or weak, restart your Wi-Fi modem. So let's now go to IP settings. You should be able to see two options. If your Android box is in static, you just change it to DHCP with your remote. Press OK. Saved successfully. Now go and check your internet connection. I'm just going to open Google Play Store. It's working. Perfect. So I'm going to go back to settings, network and internet. Go to your Wi-Fi and go to IP settings. Before you go here, if your Android box is in the HCP settings, you have to change it to static. But before that, you have to take note of this IP address. Your IP address will be different. Don't forget the dots. It's very important. So copy this in a piece of paper. Now go to IP settings. If your box is in the HCP, you change it to static. Now enter your IP address here 192.166. and so on you will have different numbers so once you have entered the IP address you just press OK here don't change this one leave it as it is this one you just press OK 24 888 don't change that Press OK. 8844, don't change it, just leave it as it is. Press OK. This is the OK here in your keyboard. Saved successfully. Now the problem should be fixed. It says excellent, and you ha I have the same IP address, and here I have static. Now just wait one or two minutes and check your internet connection. If it does not work, you just go back to IP settings and switch back to the HCP and you just press OK. One of these should work in your box, either the HCP or static. It depends on your box and it depends on your Wi-Fi connection range. If it does not work with DHCP and static, go to Forget Network, press OK, and just go back to Network and Internet, select your Wi-Fi, and enter your password. That will fix the problem. That's what I wanted to share with you today. Don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.